Hey guys, hope you're having a swell day. It's your host, The Gaming Stealth, back at it again. Today we'll be going over new evidence surfacing suggesting GTA 6 Vice City map leak is real. Let's get into the video. Grand Theft Auto 6 is undoubtedly one of the most anticipated games for the majority of players, but unfortunately very little is known about it at this point. As a result of a lack of concrete facts about GTA 6, there have been many rumors about its gameplay, location, and story. A key indicator of how the game will look and feel is its map and setting, and there has been a great deal of speculation. While many rumors have been debunked in recent years, a disregarded image has now resurfaced with increased validity. There have been claims that Grand Theft Auto 6 would return to Vice City, while others have suggested that the new game would have a South American focus. It seems that these rumors may actually hold some validity, as a source that claimed to take a photo of a take to interactive employee's laptop has been supported by a second Twitter account that shows a leaker working at the company themselves about five years ago. However, like any rumor, this should be taken with a pinch of salt. The original image that was shared one year ago primarily showed an island as well as what looks like to be more land on the bottom right corner. Many are hoping that this is a zoomed in view of an area of the map of Grand Theft Auto 6, and comments rejected the claim with the poster apparently later denying its validity. However, by hunting down the second account of the poster, it has been revealed that they may have actually been an employee at Take-Two Interactive, and some now believe that the original post was a snip of GTA set in the Americas. Players have already claimed that they want Grand Theft Auto 6 to look different than the map that has been displayed, however a fuller understanding of the game will come when Rockstar Games make an official announcement about its status and features. Whether that will come anytime soon remains to be seen, and for now this leak seems to be the closest thing that any fan has to valid information. While yet another Grand Theft Auto 5 port on the horizon, it is clear that some fans are keen to get new content. However, they still may want to hold out for an official announcement rather than placing their faith in a rumor rabbit hole that just presents some interesting information, be it unconfirmed. Also, Rockstar Games has entered the radio silence phase of production, presumably on Grand Theft Auto 6. Fans are obviously getting antsy for any news on the game, regardless of what it is. Last of the concrete news was that Grand Theft Auto was moving forward and would take a more incremental developmental approach. Both in response to developer crunch concerns as well as following the Grand Theft Auto Online content model, even that as an outsider report with no confirmation from Rockstar Games itself. Among all the leaks and rumors, of course fans are most curious about the release date of the game. Like every iteration before, Grand Theft Auto 6 has seen a bevy of leaks regarding the game, but many of the release date rumors agree on a specific time frame. Practically every rumor about the game places a release date in a broad time frame, 2021 through 2023. Of course, that would make a lot of sense given Rockstar Games' track record of recent releases. First, it's important to get some of the easy debunks out of the way. One particular rumor posted on Pastebin anonymously stated that Grand Theft Auto 6 would be released this holiday, coinciding with the release of PS5 and Xbox Series X. Supposedly, the game would be a PlayStation timed exclusive, and the game would take place in Liberty City and Vice City. This may have just been misinformation from what turned into Grand Theft Auto 5, coming to next gen, but otherwise this isn't certainly false. Another rumor was based on a theory that the casino DLC for Grand Theft Auto Online was hinting at what's to come this year, but that wasn't proven. Rumors for 2021 have popped up as well, which are a tad bit more credible, though not enough by any means to be considered factual. Speaking at the Brazil Game Show back in 2019, Trevor actor Steven Ogg reportedly stated that the games take 7-8 to eight years to make, do the math. Which frankly is not a sure release time for GTA 6 anyways. Although considering a port of Grand Theft Auto 5 is coming to PS5 or Xbox Series X, that would mean Grand Theft Auto 6 would want to release towards the end of 2021 at the earliest. A former Rockstar Games employee affirmed that theory, but also stated Rockstar places emphasis on a game quality rather than hitting a deadline. Well guys, I think it's very obvious that the map will take place for Vice City. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click on the videos on screen now or that are linked in the description below. Please be sure to like and subscribe and click the bell to get notified of every video. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Later.